Welcome back. This is just going to be a short little clip to teach people how to use Stellarium if you've never used it before. If you want to give it a shot, I was going to walk you through some basic steps on how to get to Stellarium, get in there and give it a shot. It'll only take you a few minutes and uh, you'll be an expert. Okay. This is for laptops or computers. It's not for cell phones or anything like that. So let's jump in and uh, we'll get started. So type in Stellarium and when you get here I'm just going to click on the Stellarium astronomy software and at the top just simply go to Stellarium web you don't have to download anything just click on that and you this will come up click on these three bars that'll get rid of the left side down here constellations and here we'll go on location and we'll type in Jerusalem for location and use this location now we can turn off the atmosphere that just turns off like uh, the sun and the moon, like the bright of the light from it. And then turn the landscape off to get through the, the land. Um, you can put that back there if you are you wanted to practice looking at the stars and you want to have a perspective of where these things are from the ground level. So when you get this like kind of flat, like a zoom in like this, zooming in zooming out we zoom in and you kind of look you can kind of start looking up and this is the perspective of how it would be if you're standing on the ground okay so next i want to show you the date down in the lower right tap the date and then you can set this uh let's set this back to i don't know let's just go for the Revelation 12. Then uh, let's let's go for <laughs> let's go for the first seal. Why not? Um, so go to December 26. Actually, it's the 25th in Jerusalem, which is like just a half an hour before. So let's let's find the rider and a horse. There's the Virgin. Libra. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the gonna get rid of the uh, the ground here so there it is there it is okay and normally because it's an eclipse and it's the rider and horse you wouldn't see um, you wouldn't see that you wouldn't see that constellation really you could put the atmosphere back on see the Sun's right there you it'd be too bright to see all these stars right um, unless it's actually eclipsed which that's just a yeah, we're here to teach how to use Stellarium. Sorry, I'm getting off track. So, take off atmosphere and landscape. So, you have it here. So, you can tap on the date again, and you can go forward in time. Uh, you can go backwards by the hour. And, and you'll notice every time you tap backwards, everything wants to slide on you. So, just keep it from sliding away. Tap on something that's stationary, like the they got the, uh, the rider on a horse or Sagittarius, and then hit the bullseye to center it once you do that then you can go back to the date and you can go back in time and the rider and the horse will stay there it'll it'll go in circles but it, it won't like scroll away left to right or off the top of the screen or the bottom of the screen and yeah so that's basically it using Stellarium it's pretty easy um, so if you've never used it you can get started by doing those simple steps all right well there you go wasn't that hard i hope you enjoy it and uh god bless